They get so broken up from getting yes. shot at by a million different. Oh people. my god! No, oh, I was looking at the reflection on the sign. I was like, somebody's like right there. Nobody better be in our dang spot. Where have you been, man? There's been people saying, "What happened to Preston? What happened on to the Pre channel no yeah, more?" Yeah, somebody DM me like. Uh, where you been? I haven't seen you on the videos. You quit or something? Did you piss him off too, Bob? That's, you yes, suck. That's what it said. Oh, I bet it did. It did. People just expect the work. I know. What are you doing, man? We got old Stinky out here. Uh-huh. He got sprayed by a skunk yesterday. Did you give him a tomato juice bath? No. Peroxide, baking soda, and dish soap. That's not, he didn't smell bad. Yeah. Yo! What up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. We got old Stinky Frederick. He got sprayed out here yesterday by a skunk. Hopefully not again today, two days in a row. Let's hope not. Look at that new Ducks waterfowl blind bag, baby. Uh-huh, got all my stuff in there. Got my, check it out. Got the old Ducks game strap, uh-huh. The old, old school camo hoodie, uh-huh. Old school camo hat. Uh huh. If you guys want to pick up any of this Ducks Waterfowl stuff, it is awesome. Lots of new products over there. Use code Bob at checkout at DucksWaterfowl.com. Uh, it will be linked at the top of the description down below. Well, we're out here. I probably look like I'm ready to start telling you a ghost story, but we're about to start telling you a duck hunting story. <laughs> uh, yep. This morning, uh, me and OP did. Um, He's been he's been slacking. He's been he's been off in La La Land doing his summer BS, just BS and like Pete P. Diddy does during the, the summer times. Mm -hmm. You do a lot of BS and during the summer. I do. I try and stay do a bunch of fun things, but this is my first time duck hunting this year. The season's been open what a month. No teal. No teal. Well, because of the bottoms, that's yeah. for one thing. But here we are. Finally. Check out the old Is that the first shot? No, I didn't hear it. No, if, if you if it, you'll hear the first shot, I'll tell you that right now. It's loud. That sunrise is beautiful. We got old Fred again today. Yep. Uh, a couple days ago, a couple days ago he got sprayed by a skunk. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. I used peroxide, baking soda, and dish soap, and it seemed to help. Although all the cuts on my hands hurt like H-E double hockey sticks, and you could tell it was really uncomfortable on his. Did you hear that? Was that a whole group of teal that yeah. just went right above her head? We got one minute too. We have one minute. All right, I'm gonna shut up. Let's roll. I got the 20 gauge today. I'm shooting uh, Federal Blue Box uh, number four. It's ounce and it's it is three quarter ounce, so it's still like 1450 FPS. So should do all right. I'm shooting the 28 gauge with the yeah. Uh, Hold federal, on, man. Let's look at you. The federal Rob Roberts. Federal Rob Roberts Custom 28 loads. gauge. Let's see the 12, 28. She's a little pretty to be bringing out here, but. Over and under 28. I love shooting ducks with it. Yeah, buddy, let's roll. Yep, I got the old 20 myself. The old public land hail Man, dude, yesterday the gadwall responded to the call like, really? oh my God, yeah. Are you doing the driver phone? No, just, okay. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is that a dog? Right here on the right, there we go. There's a big duck there. Shoot him. Nice shot. Fred! Oh, right in front of us. What the hell? Teal. See that teal? Yeah, he landed. He landed. Dead bird. That, there was three there. Dead bird. Here, here. Good shot, I totally landed. <laughs> Good, boom, drop. Old Gadwall. We're gonna stand out of the cattails up here for a minute. Cause it's low light and these birds cannot see us at all. Come on, hope you all can see something here. Come on guys, smash the old thumbs up for me, Frederick and old P did, we're out here. The boys are back. We're only uh, two weeks from Aaron getting in town and three weeks from our first client group, dude. That's crazy. Yeah, speaking of which, um, I have some early November dates that I'm doing spe special rates on. It's our first couple groups that we have. Um, so we're accepting anything from two uh, at a time to three to four, five, six, whatever. I got one date that can have an entire group of eight or more. So and Then we got some December and January dates, but not many. So if you guys are interested, sandhillflyways.com, fill out the booking form, make sure your phone number is correct so I can get a hold of you. Let's set something up for you. A lot of father-sons, man. 
ton of father sons this year. I'm really excited. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'm telling you, it's money out here. Like, it's good. Real yeah. good. Over the back right here, too. Coming over the top. Shoot them. That's a pintail. Those are both pintails. We get them both? Yes! <laughs> Fred! <laughs> Dude, that was sick. Good eye. Yeah. Fred here. Where is he going, man? Over here, dude. <laughs> All right. Did you see where yours yeah, fell? They're both right. They're both in here. They dead bird. They land right there. Right when I shot, I went to go shoot the second one. I'm like, oh no no, those are pintails. Hopefully you can get. Oh, there's one. Fred got one. Here here here. Drop. There's one. The hen, and then Fred, that, oh, there's the other one. Right, right next there. to each other. Yeah, literally right next to each other. Both Susies? Both Susies, take your pick. Good Lord. <laughs> dude, that was yeah, perfect that was shooting, awesome. dude. <laughs> oh, that couldn't have worked any better. Missed the first one, though, for me. Oh, I did. missed the first shot. You did miss the first shot? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. That's all right. First pintail. Look at that wad of ducks coming at us. Rick, crouch down. Coming over the bushes. Sit. Coming right in front of us, right there. All right, let's go. Hell yeah. That was bad. Right when there, dude. Right when I pulled him, I seen the long neck. I'm like. Only one, only one. That's a thing. You'll see so many damn pintail today. I guarantee it. You can only shoot one of the son of a gun. That is crazy. That I get that law. I understand it, but today you'll see. I mean, just as many teal or pintail as gadwall. Yeah. You know, and there's a lot of gadwall here. Like a lot more teal, but I'll take it though. First pintail of the year, bam bam. Small boars, uh-huh. This is money. I did switch up the decoy spread. Look at that right there. Oh gosh, look at that. Great. Isn't it bad, dude? Coming on the right again. Teal. I'll shoot some teal, I didn't I'll shoot one or something, yeah. Uh, get in there. Oh yeah, shoot him. I oh, shot, no. I think I shot one. I got Fred. I got one too. Oh, never mind. He got up. I thought that's the one I Fred! Got. Fred! He's chasing one or something. Fred, dead bird! Dead bird! Good boy! Dude, they came all the way up in this thing. I didn't know where to shoot. Drop. Blue wing. <laughs> I only got three left, so I'm I'm gonna be choosy. I'm going for big ducks. Three more big ducks, and I'm done. It is only been it is 7:21 shooting light was 7:08. Yeah. I mean, if we really wanted to, we could dang near be done already. Yeah. I could hit anything, dude. They landed literally right there, carved around yeah. the mojos. Yeah, Ooh, right here on the. I thought you were going to take it. I'm going to back up a little bit because there's this is a lot of your shooting over here yeah. too. Let's get ready. Shoot him right here. Go. Nice. Oh, two, yeah. Two in one. <laughs> Fred. Dude, God, stone cold. Oh, dude. Two of them in one shot. Nah, he didn't see it go down. We're going to have to go walk it out. Fred here. Hey, hey. Fred. Oh, look at that. Oof. I don't want any more teal. I just want big ducks right here. Look at this group, dude. They're everywhere. Here's the spread. We got look Preston. Look, look, look. Oh my God. Oh, we got Preston's gadwall. I think we got a dozen gadwall and a dozen pintails, pretty much. And they look good. They both fell right here. That was a heck of a shot coming right at us. Big duck. 
Oh, that's spoon. Is that a spoonie? Fred, Fred, in here. Fred! Okay, come here, you stompasaurus. Sit. This would be good hunting on this on the south side. The other one's got to be right here. He probably dove. Dead bird. Dead bird. Well, we found one. Give it a minute and search again. That one, that one was still alive, so that other one probably dove on it. Spread looks good. Uh, a little backwards wind today. Is it out of the north now? Does it feel like it? It does, don't it? A little bit. A little bit more than it was. I'm gonna have to turn the old mojos around. Okay. I mean the old lucky ducks. I ain't using the mojos. I've been liking the old lucky ducks. Did you think about them now? They last. Yeah, they, they last so long. Dude, and you recharge them, they last. That's the thing about lucky ducks. You recharge them and they just last. They are built really good, which Troy was telling me his uh he sent all of his mojo stuff in that was broke. All of it. And it was like 25 bucks to have it replaced or, or like fixed. Like one of his mojos, he thought the motor was out and it just need grease. Huh. You know? So I mean that's a good deal too. Teal? That's a dark looking teal. What if we shot a cinnamon dude? Wouldn't that be cool? On the old high and dry pole. Uh-huh. Got our drinks down there. Ah, yeah, buddy. I'm telling you right now, the high and dry utility pole, I call it the best duck hunting pole ever made. That's what it ought to be called. Because the utility pole, people don't understand what a utility pole is. That's a duck hunting pole right there. And it will keep all of your stuff up out of the water, hands free while you're out here. Uh, they're actually, we have partnered up really well. They treat me really good and they treat all of you really good, all of my subscribers and fans. Uh, use code Bob at checkout at highanddryoutdoors.com. It's always linked down below for a huge discount and they're giving a uh, like $25 uh, gift to everybody as well. So you get a huge discount plus a gift and the gift is the leather loop that goes right here. So you hang your gun right there. Mine's still attached on my 12 gauge and I forgot to put it on here this morning. So awesome deal. Go check it out, guys. These poles are definitely worth it. American made, one heck of a warranty on them. Well, you shoot that single. Oh, come on. <laughs> He's still there. There's two of them on the water. They're, they're still swimming around. Did you wound? Did you wound that one? See no, him? I, I didn't even hit it. Do you see him? No, I shot on the other side of the mojos. Okay. I do see him, yeah. There's two in there. Oh, he doesn't want to leave. There's two on the water still. You don't have to shoot them. Up to you. I'm quick enough when they get up. <laughs> that he just shot, and the birds are still gonna just sit there and swim around. That tells me there's a lot of new dumb birds here, like 100%. Look at the birds up top. Big ducks. My coal. Here, it's coming back. Is he? All oh, you. I got a gaddy. Did he land? Yeah. <clears throat> I got my duck call now. Oh, there he is in the little things. <laughs> oh, I landed in there. Think you can get him? Get him! Oh! Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Behind them and then over. <laughs> oh, I'm loving this. This is see. This is why I came today, right here. This is why I came. You want to see how rusty I am? <laughs> oh, crusty, rusty. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Look at him. This bad. <laughs> I was he was in your grill. No, I was telling. I went on my first like bird shoot of the year. I went through three boxes of shells shooting dove that were in my face. Oh, well, it happens. We're getting what, there. What's that? What's that thing choked at? Improved mod and modified. Well, that ain't bad. There's no dead bird, Fred. Freddy. Fred. Daddy didn't shoot. Preston did. You know nothing fell. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, it's poop talking time. Look at that group up there. It just came from freaking nowhere. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Teal? Teal? Dude, this is wonderful. Yeah. I love it. We'll start seeing some migrating specks here in a little bit. Well, dude, it's like, this is, you're actually seeing large groups of birds. Yes. Where, uh, like Cheyenne Bottoms, are, they get so broken up from getting yes. shot at by a million different birds. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, hit me in the head. Oh my, isn't that cool, man? That doesn't happen. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, you just gotta take it in. Coming back. Yep. <laughs> right in your grill. Oh, there you go. He didn't. He didn't get to watch it go down. Maybe. Oh, get them! They are tearing them up over yonder. I'll go help Fred real quick. I don't know if he marked it very well. He might. Dead bird! Oh, is that a big duck? Yeah. Is it? That's a teal. Get him. That's a teal. No, over here. Oh my God, look at these birds. Dead bird! Dead bird! He didn't get to mark it very well. What is it? Greenhead. Are you one. sure? Yeah. Was it? I saw the white belly. <laughs> Coming back from the back. Let's go after that stud muffin, even if we just get him down. Want to shoot him up top? Yeah. Shoot him. Oh, there we go. You going down? Nope. No. He was. That was a greenhead. <sighs> Oh, he's falling. Look, he fell way over there. Oh no. How far was that? That was a long shot, dude. He fell like 200 yards away. We're gonna have to try though. Oh. Oh, that mallard. I dropped him. Probably 200 yards he fell. It was a long shot. I knew that was gonna happen. That second shot, I could tell I hit him. And I was like, oh my God, he's going to sail for a long way. And sure enough, he dropped Ooh. an easy 200 yards away. We're gonna, we're gonna go try. Oh, me and Fred are out here still looking. Dead bird. Dead bird, hunt him up. Oh my God. Fred found him and he doesn't even know it. So I could tell Fred winded him. For sure he winded him. Look, look Fred, right here. Fred, look, there he is. Good boy. Okay, drop me, you gonna just. Look at that. First mallard of the year. Man, he's got some awesome white colors on him. Just starting to get some green on his head, just on the top. Yes. Cannot believe I found him. I'm gonna walk out the distance. Holy smokes. First mallard of the year, baby. It was worth the work. Man, look where I hit him. Told you, just one in the gut, that, and he flew a good, uh, see his, I'm gonna guess 250 yards. I'll map it out for you guys real quick. We were looking for about 20 minutes. Found him. I could tell he found him. Uh, he scented him, he winded him, and he kept, he wouldn't put his nose, or he wouldn't pick his nose up. So I was like, he has to be right here somewhere. And sure enough, Fred was just doing circles around him. The grass is about knee high. Yes, dude. If you haven't smashed the thumbs up, come on. Help me get this video going. First mallard of the year, baby. Good boy. All right. Got him. Dude, 
272 yards away in freaking thick grass and Fred found him. He was right where you said he'd be. He winded him and just started doing circles so I knew the duck was there and there he was. What? That's unbelievable. I can't believe it. Yeah, Two. I, there was no way. I know. 272 freaking yards away. That just tells you you got a duck that lands on dry ground. It is. Huh? It's a drake? Yeah. He's got a little green on the top of his head. He's a big guy though. Isn't he cool? He born yesterday. Look at that. Big old muffin. He's a big old duck, dude. Look, I barely got him in the gut. Little lung action. Oh. Feels good to hold a big old bird. Right. That's a giant, man. I've been I've been used to dove and teal. We well, only got one duck or two ducks left. I got two. I got. I kind of want two big dude, ducks. Dude, I looked for probably the whole time you're gone. I was looking for that double. Still can't find a second one. There was a couple that dove on us the other day, but Fred did find them. We, we lost one. There's just so much vegetation that they can get under the water and hook onto it. Yeah. That's a good boy. Yeah. I still really wish I had a, I have a mow marsh for Fred and I wish I could bring it out here, but with the equipment, man, that, I don't know if y'all own a mow marsh. You know, it's the platforms that fold up. You can either, uh, put a dog line on the top where it's just a platform but they're really heavy if it was just a if it was half as heavy i could carry it in well and they're awkward like they're an awkward size yeah they're yeah. big um but I, again like do we need that many floaters like we got two dozen floaters do we actually need i think if anything once they see the mojos they're... exactly the mojos do the job um the luckies do the job um, I don't know. I need to, I wish I could just find something like smaller and a lot lighter. Mm -hmm. Just, a, just enough for him to get up out of the water. I might build something, you know, definitely probably won't build something. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded good. It sounded good. I would like to find something though. It wouldn't have to be very tall either. Just a foot tall. Somebody could make a nice little aluminum platform. You can aluminum with some kick out legs. You could probably fit strap in your it, you bungee it on the backpack. That's yeah. what I need. Aluminum. That would be really light. I might look around for like a little aluminum something. Cut the legs on it or something. Yeah. It, two hen mallards. Come back up. Overhead. You want to pop them if so? Oh. I'm, those are spo are they spoonies? Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> well, they hated it. That's a big group of teal. <laughs> Here we go. Four, five, five pack. Get ready. Oh, cool. Public land. <laughs> well, they were doing it. God, it literally never fails. Every time, dude. Every time. And it's only the ones you're working. Oh yeah, like they were actually working. I turned them on the call and ba-boom, baby. Guarantee you those guys sky busted at that big group of till that was 200 yards in the damn air. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. We just got done picking up. I looked over. Dude has waiter sweats, a camo hoodie, and a hat. Yeah, I got spotted the bucket you. hat in there. I got <laughs> another one of these in there. Oh yeah. yeah. He's like, he's he is really super Ooh, cool. he's tiny too. Yeah. Look at his feather butt. Oh yeah, see that? He's Ooh. just young. Yeah, you guys shot a bunch yeah. of green. Young yeah, and we no, not, not much color going on. Yeah, this oh is yeah, the lots of... Ring and oh, the whole ringy. That's right up your alley, buddy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dang. He used to be the... We used to call him Bluebill. Yeah, that's my first one. So really? Yeah, Heck yeah. Nice shoot, guys. Yeah, if we don't know you guys were here, we'd 
Could have came and joined yeah. us. We had a bunch of birds. Did you? Dude, I seen them suck down on you guys over here. It's yeah. a good group. It's a really big opening, a big pool of water right there. It's about Dude, there's good water out here. Deep, I'm so. really surprised. Your criticism, pessimism, 